Some of our pain points we've had at the LEGO group uh, in the conversion funnel uh, was showing up in analytics, but we were having difficulty of identifying what those actual experiences were. So Decibel was able to show us what we were seeing in the data, but also identify a lot of the pain points that were happening through replays, through heat maps, and through scroll uh, sessions that were able to make easy modifications that I don't think we would have been able to identify without doing a lot of lab research. I use DXS as a, a score to uh, measure the experience and within the LEGO group, um, experience is, is a, a very important aspect from our products, be it uh, the, uh, the LEGO bricks uh, or our website presence and it's a way to identify areas of the site that are performing well, which is always great, or identifying pain points that we might not have known about. It's a general score that is valuable, and the score is something that we can easily communicate through uh, all levels of the company, from the C-level down to developers as well. A really easy example to explain is that uh, within the checkout flow, we had icons for the different types of credit cards for each country that you're, the shopper is in. And we didn't realize that there was a, people were clicking, multi-clicking on uh, icons of the credit cards thinking they're selecting them, but it wasn't a clickable element. So uh, that helped us remove a pain point that wasn't showing up in any other way other than people were spending a lot of time on the page and we were getting a little bit more bounce rate than we expected. So after reviewing sessions and looking at the heat maps, we were able to quickly identify it, communicate it to the uh, uh, the developers and the, the UX team to take it, a look at it and redesign it to remove those pain points. One of the best things about the Decibel team is how easy it is and how easy it is to communicate and share information visually. I've been using uh, the Decibel tool for over two years now and I've seen it evolve and it's an improving and improving and increasing easy to use uh, aspects of it as well as great data that we're, we're, we're able to access that we wouldn't be able to in any other tool.